John Alzheimer is known as one of our nation's most recognized credit experts. Having worked for 28 years in the credit industry, John has become one of the most prolific speakers about credit and the go-to authority on answers to credit-related questions. Credit Countdown with John Alzheimer. Hello, my name is John Alzheimer. I am a consumer credit expert. I've got almost 30 years of experience in the credit industry. I have spent time at FICO, which is the company that designed and designs and develops the FICO credit scoring system, and Equifax, which is one of the three generally recognized credit reporting agencies in the United States. And so today's question has to do with credit repair and the effectiveness of credit repair relative to late payments. So specifically, can a credit repair company remove late payments from your credit report? So before we dig into that, let's talk a little bit about what is credit repair. Credit repair is actually a verb, it is a process. It's a process whereby a company or you um, attempts to get information removed or corrected from their credit reports prior to the time limit imposed upon reporting such things by the Fair Credit Reporting Act, okay? So, it, I mean, in English, it's basically you're trying to get stuff off your credit report early. That's probably the best way to describe it um, in, in, simple, in simple terms. What is a credit repair company? So this is a noun, this is an actual thing. A, a credit repair company is actually defined by the Credit Repair Organizations Act. And this would be a for-profit company that markets any service to a consumer that is billed or marketed as um, helping to improve their credit report or credit score. Any derivative of that is also going to apply. And so you can't hide behind, you know, you know, we charge a fee to help educate people about their credit scores. No, you can't hide behind some sort of clever wording. Um, the FTC is not stupid. Uh, and so to the extent that you're charging somebody and you're for profit, uh, and you are um, doing something to help them to improve their credit score, then you are a credit repair company whether you want to be one or not, okay? And that's straight out of the Credit Repair Organizations Act, which sets the rules vis-a-vis -vis what is a credit repair company and what are they allowed to do. So can credit repair companies remove late payments? So first off, if the late payment is accurate, meaning that it is actually correct, then the credit reporting companies can maintain that information on your credit reports for no longer than seven years. And so seven years is the uppermost boundary. There's no requirement that they maintain it for seven years, but that's, as, that's how long it can remain on a credit report. And so if you have a, you know, a late payment on your credit report that occurred three years ago this month, uh, then that late payment can stay on your credit report for four more years. Can a credit repair company remove it? Really, this is a binary question. The answer is either yes or no. The answer to your question is certainly yes. It doesn't mean that I'm um, endorsing credit repair or I'm, I'm suggesting that you go out and hire a credit repair company. I'm just saying that it is a fact that credit repair companies are effective in their work. Um, I've seen it firsthand, uh, a credit repair company able to get information removed from consumers' credit reports. So the answer to the question is certainly yes. Anyone who tells you that their services are not effective and that they don't work is that 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 is not what I that's not been my observation from my seat. Can you do this yourself? Of course you can. So what a credit repair company will generally do is they will generally file disputes on your behalf with the credit repair agencies. I'm sorry, with the credit reporting agencies challenging the validity of the late payment. And if the credit reporting agency cannot verify the accuracy of the late payment, they must remove it. If the credit reporting, credit reporting agency contacts the furnishing party, which is usually a bank, credit card issuer, um, some sort of a financial services company, and the financial services company directs the credit bureaus to remove the late payment, then they will likely do so. If the furnishing party does not respond to the credit reporting agency, uh, request to investigate the late payment, then it is what's called not verifiable or unverifiable. And again, the credit reporting agencies will remove it. So there are a lot of conditions whereby a credit reporting agency will remove a late payment. Unverifiable, uh, they just choose to do so as a matter of policy. The furnishing party doesn't respond to the dispute. The furnishing party does respond and directs the credit reporting agency to remove it. So you have a lot of scenarios whereby you can cause a late payment to be removed. It doesn't necessarily mean that you have to pay someone to do this. You can certainly file disputes yourself um, at no cost 
with the credit reporting agencies. Look, I am not the morality police. I, have, I am neutral as it pertains to credit repair. If you want to go pay someone to mow your lawn or cut your hair or do your taxes or do accounting for you or change the oil in your car, I'm totally fine with that. If you want to do it yourself, then do it yourself. If you want to pay someone to challenge information on your credit reports because you don't want to waste the time to do it, then fine, as long as they follow the rules imposed by the Credit Repair Organizations Act, then, then they're not breaking the law. That's one of the, the, false, uh, the false myths about, um, about credit repair is that it's illegal. It's not universally illegal. It's illegal in Georgia where I live. It's a misdemeanor to do credit repair, but every other state, it's perfectly legal as long as you're following the rules of the Credit Repair Organizations Act. So seven years is the limit. Credit repair companies generally charge a monthly fee, usually in the neighborhood of $59 to $129, depending on the company and depending on kind of the level of service that you're paying for. Um, and it's usually a subscription, meaning at the end of every month, your credit card is gonna be billed uh, for the services rendered the prior 30 days, which is a requirement under the CROA. You cannot bill in advance for these types of services. You can only bill after the services have been fully rendered. So if you have any questions about late payments or credit repair or removing late payments, I'll be happy to answer them. Drop them in the comment section below. Have a great rest of your day and we'll talk again soon. For more videos and credit tips from John Olsheimer, go to www.tradelinesupply.com.